Hey, Cher, what information did they give you? Okay, they gave you that the elastomers are black. Did they say what they're pumping? Okay, they didn't. All right, we need to ask more questions because we've narrowed it down a little bit, but, but we need to ask some more questions. Okay, I'll talk with you in a little bit. Hey everybody, it's Elise with Reliable, and you guessed it, today we're talking about elastomers, the mysterious word elastomers. So by definition, elastomer is usually referencing something rubber internal inside of something. But today, I've got a, a number of Wilden diaphragms here in front of us, different elastomer options. Now, as you can see, we've got a few that are the same color. So, how do we identify elastomers? When we get customers who call in, which is frequent, every day we get calls in for rebuild kits or new pumps. And the biggest question that is the mysterious question is what are the elastomers inside of the pump? Now, first and foremost, the question usually back from customers, what are you talking about? What are elastomers? And the biggest thing for us is that we don't know what the elastomers are inside the pump if you don't have a pump tag, which shows us the model number, the series, and the description of the pump. Nine times out of 10, if you've watched any of our previous videos, you know that that tag falls off through the years. So we take some time and please don't be offended. We ask a lot of questions and there's a reason we ask questions. So from the outside of the pump, now Wilden has many, many different series. From the outside of the pump, you cannot tell nine times out of 10, if not 95% of the time, what the elastomers are internally, unless you've taken that pump apart in the past or you've taken it apart at that present time. So we get a lot of resistance, I, I'd like to say, back from people more so, well, why don't you know what the elastomers are inside of the pump? Why don't you know what material the diaphragms are from the outside? It's kind of like looking at the house from the front, any house. Do you know what the flooring material is inside the house? No, you'd have to open the door and go inside. Same for the diaphragms. So here we have a few in front of us and I'd like to go through these a little bit with you, just kind of give you a little brief, what goes in what type of deal. Um, Wilden has used a numbering system starting with 50 and up as the numbers after the main diaphragm part numbers. So these are 04 part numbers and the diaphragms for the most part start with a 04-1010 or 1010 as I say usually over the phone. Their first diaphragm, which I don't have here, is a 5-0, which is polyurethane. It is not a popular rubber diaphragm. Uh, Wilden used to use it years back, but it's not the go-to, it's not something that is readily stocked. This, however, is a neoprene diaphragm. It is a black rubber. The reason I know it's neoprene, number one, there is a part number of a 04-1010-51 and the infamous green dot. Now, if you were to call and say the diaphragms are black, like the phone call that Sherry in our office was just on, they could be neoprene, they could be our dash 52, Vuna. They could also be a dash 53, which is Viton. I don't have an example of a Viton in front of me, or a dash 54, which is Nordell or EPDM. This black diaphragm here is a backup diaphragm for a PTFE fitted pump, which would be a dash 55. And then you have a dash 56, we go into the thermoplastics now, PTFE, Saniflex, Wilflex, all thermoplastics. The lower numbers are all uh, rubber materials. So why the differences? There, there's a variety of reasons, but primarily the reason is chemical compatibility. Why would you spend a tremendous amount of money buying a PTFE diaphragm, which is one of the most expensive next to the Viton and the Gore-Tex, which is a custom diaphragm, when you don't need it? If you're pumping water, uh, if you're pumping water with a little bit of sand and abrasives in it, for just water, you're gonna go with a neoprene most likely, unless there's a Wilflex available. And these two are uh, very, very good at your general neutral solutions. Wilflex is primarily used in a lot of plating facilities. It's used in waste treatment for filter press applications. It's a good all around, but it doesn't, it's just got no flex to it. So it's a thermoplastic, while the neoprene has flex to it. It's a rubber material. 
Now in a situation where someone says the diaphragms are black, the question is, what are you pumping? If you're pumping oils, you're gonna use the buna. If you're pumping, excuse me, if you're pumping fuel, gasoline, you're gonna use the Viton, which is neck and neck in price with the PTFE, but gasoline pumping is dangerous. So you need to make sure you have the right material elastomer. So what we need customers to do um, is number one, to not mind the many questions because we don't want to get you the wrong kit because that's time and time is money, is answer the questions. And the biggest question next we would get is, are they interchangeable? Sometimes. So Wilden's inner plates, the pistons that sandwich the diaphragm to the shaft. So you've got your outer and your inner piston, and then they, those attach to the shaft that go through the center section of the pump. The Pistons between the rubber and the Wilflex fitted pumps are different than the PTFE fitted pumps if you have the older style 101055 diaphragm. Now, Wilden made a change in their designs. They call it now a full stroke PTFE diaphragm where the pistons are all the same. Then you can interchange from a PTFE if it's full stroke to a neoprene or a Buna or a Wilflex. But if you're not sure, it's best to take apart the pump it's best to take a bunch of pictures and send them to us and we can ID them. We can ID the center section, which style air motor, whether it's the turbo flow, the P series, the PX obsoleted series, their old obsoleted W series and their new PS series. So again, this is kind of just a get close and personal with some elastomer options and why we ask the questions and why it's so important because again, we don't wanna get you the wrong kit. We don't wanna get you the wrong diaphragms. You can order all of these parts individually. They are all genuine Wilden parts. We are here to help you. We are here to help ID what you have to get you the right parts, if not a new pump. And that's what we do. So if you have any questions, please call us at 203-740-1877. Email us at sales at reliable-equipment.com. Again, my name is Elise and I'm here to help. Thank you so much.